welcome to our myself professor deshmukh ms presenting the theory lectures based on tribology now in this case we will see the governing equation of elasto hydrodynamic lubrication now before going to starting the governing equations what is the elasto hydrodynamic lubrication it quite easier elasto hydrodynamic lubrication is nothing but the what it is the combination of elastic deformation and that of pure dynamic action of the body which are in a contact so elastic deformation is very important elastic deformations which create the cavity or reservoir for the lubrication purpose so this is the governing equation now see what is the governing equations now look at here diagram is showing the contacted sliding with the u velocity the contact at the particles sliding in x direction so in three dimensional that is x1 x2 and x3 these are the three kind of the possible displacement of the body which will be traveling this simplified model now come to the governing equations consider the half space s which contain the n orbitally shapes inclusion domains okay with respect to x1 x2 and x3 at under the x1 x2 something value is by x3 zero as its on surface at two dimensional only the material properties of the matrix of the half space s and the inclusion domain is provided by lems constant lambda plus mu poisson's ratio nu the young modulus e1 and listed in the nomenclature okay so governing equation by inclusion problem will be showing here the principal equivalent inclusion for the general half space is described in the figure that figure is showing in before okay so 2 mu u ei in bracket x1 comma x2 comma x3 is toy g f i j j minus f k k i where i represent the galerkin vectors expressed in the form the triple integer a and b are constant a is equal to mu v upon 2 pi 1 minus v1 beta b mu upon 4 pi 1 minus v1 gc and g jk are basic galerkin vectors so look at this these are the two conditions that is the eigen strain and the positive eigen strain domain values are there figure shows e is equal to that is eigen strain on each e 11 e 22 e 33 e 12 e 13 e 23 
so what happened in this case that is the, the eigen value that, that is the eigen strength because of there is the reformation in the elastic form and which will be showing here the principal equivalent inclusion in the inclusion domain okay with elastic modulus et is less than em and after it is equivalent to the new domain which is called as what same as a material as a matrix the new domain with contrast now this is the matrices that we got some deflection in uh, different directions inclusion they are also given these are the dimensionless methods thickness dimensionless film thickness h r e b square dimensionless pressure p is equal to p upon p h dimensionless velocity u is equal to eta 0 mu upon e dash r e material parameter gm is equal to alpha e load parameter w is equal to w upon e dash r e so these are the things where we are see that the elastic deformation how to calculate so it is calculated in terms of the strain that is called as what eigen strain so what should be the maximum and minimum that also be calculated through this so this is all about the governing equation of the state of this ehi l quite easier to understand the concept of this different problem the elastic deformation caused by inclusions